All right, guys, today we're gonna be changing a uh, gas spring in the steering column. Here's the spring, you got two pins. And the complaint was that the steering column, well, there's nothing there to, to uh, hold it. So we're gonna change this out and I'm gonna show you how to do it. First, you need to remove this panel here and your gas shock's right underneath there. So we're gonna have to remove this other plastic, this one right here pop this off also all right so you're gonna have to remove this panel off the dash this section right here and then you got two screws holding this plastic on so you're gonna have to take those off and then uh, then we can get to the cylinder and knock the pins out all right now we got all the plastics off we're gonna take these pins out you got to knock them out with the hammer put the new cylinder in and then uh, put everything back together all right guys, you can see this is the new one and that's the old one. The old one just leaked everything out and this one is a little bit different. The handles are not the same, but that's a total source part. That's why that's OEM on the left side. So you got to knock these pins out, pain in the neck, but just use some PB blaster or some kind of lubricant to loosen up because of the rust for being outside. So let's pop this thing back on. Okay, now we got the new pins in, kind of a pain in the neck. And I got the bottom pin in. So now you have your tilt back. Let's see, ready to go. Let's put all the panels back on and call it a day. All right guys, it's all back together. Tilt's working good. You have to remove all these panels, remember. Should take you about 20, 25 minutes on a good day. On a bad day, if those pins are stuck in there, then uh, yeah, it'll take you a little bit longer. Thanks for watching.